Hello YouTube, I'm back with another tutorial for M Creator. I will be showing you today how to make your own biome for M Creator. So let's get started. Let's start up M Creator. I already made some blocks and stuff like that that we'll need for the um, project, so it's already pre-made. Um, we need biome, biome, there we go. Let's call it, um, I don't know, I'm not feeling really creative right now. New, new biome. Okay, so the floor is basically the orange right here. They have a nice little example showing you what it is. So the floor, we're gonna set it to clay because I feel like it. Clay. There we go. Um, the ground block. I made a pre ground block. It is located. Block of ruby, block of ore, bark, new grass. That's the one. Um, yes, we want it to generate lakes. Custom tree. Yes, we want that. We're not going to use vines. Um, branches, yes, we have one for that. It's called bark. And, oh wait, no, branches. Branches are purple, so that's something different. Let's see. seeing it. Should have generated. Um that's weird. It should look kinda like um bark. I guess we're just going to use um, a different leaf for that. Uh, and the stem is obviously bark. So. And the fruits, we don't have any fruit. So. Next, it's really as simple as this. some reason it doesn't want to work. Alright, I guess he had to fill out all of it, if you liked it or not. Um, trees per chunk. Let's go ten. Oh no, about sixteen by sixteen. So that's pretty good, fair space. So let's go six grass per chunk. Um, sixteen times it's two fifty six. So. Flowers per chunk. Oh wait, that the top, they're talking about the um, tall grass. So let's just go six flowers per chunk. Five, or well, maybe six. I don't know. Mushrooms three. Sand um, twelve. 
well, reeds. Reeds is basically um, sugar cane, so 12. Cacti, we're not going to spawn any cacti. Dead shrubs, no. Raining prior possibility. Uh, I don't want it to rain at all. Minimum height difference. search for this biome after we're done creating it, so. <clears throat> All we have after this is mob and commands. We're almost finished the tutorial. It's done. Now it's going to start the uh, Minecraft environment, aka exe file for Minecraft. <laughs> and then it's just a matter of finding the biome, which can sometimes be hard. <laughs> basically saying, when you created this world, it had this, and now it doesn't exist. You're going, mm-hmm, yeah, okay, that's fine, seriously, I know, I know I deleted it.
this lo trunk loaded, please? This is one big ass desert. Holy cows. I'm like right at the border right here. It's like not loaded. I know it works because I've created a biome with it before and it worked. But, you know, finding it was hard. <laughs> it's one of the hardest parts of creating a biome is not so much creating it. Creating it's the easy part, just finding it. Doesn't seem to be loading.
cut the film here until I can find one, and then I'm gonna just um. Start. Hang on a second. Alright, if I was able to generate a new world and one generated, but there is a small problem. Uh, I didn't place the right material on the bottom. Obviously, the whole top layer was supposed to be on the bottom layer. So, basically, the bottom layer is on the top layer. So this is clay. <laughs> That's the funny part, is. Um, and this right here is supposed to be on the top. Uh, it's about like too thick, but yeah, whatever. The interesting thing is, it does generate. Um, oh wait, hold on a second. No, that's just regular. Looks like these trees are falling apart. Oh, this is the wood right there because trees can't generate on <coughs> clay. Um, <laughs> yeah, so it's generating off to the side. That's the reason. Um, yeah. Dude's clay biome if anyone needs it. <laughs> um, anyways, this is my artwork on freaking palm trees. It's just supposed to be a palm tree. And yeah, I guess the leaves don't want to take to it. But that's okay. It doesn't have to, it's just a demonstration. Um, yeah. Anyways, if you like my tutorial, subscribe. Um, we still have mobs to cover, cover and commands. Uh, stay tuned for those. And, um, thank you for watching.